good morning everyone today we will discuss uh, how to approach radiology residency first of all i would like to congratulate every radiology resident who has recently joined the smart wise approach is very important in the radiology residency because there are so many books to study but you have to be smart enough to do everything in a concise way so first of all we will start with the ultrasound in ultrasound you can buy rumex diagnostic ultrasound in rumex diagnostic ultrasound you have to study every single chapter of the fetal radiology and for the rest of the systems you can see the images and you can read the findings given below and the tables which are very very important next is uh, atlas of ultrasound in obstetrics and gynecology by peter and carol and barrel so this you can keep a soft copy and it is basically the images are given very nicely in this book next book is a that is introduction to vascular ultrasonography by pallerito and pollock so all the doppler studies you can study from here this also you can have it in your ipad next very important online platforms from where you can study while doing an ultrasound that is the radiopedia and the radiology assistant radiopedia will definitely help you next is chest radiographs for the chest radiographs a must buy book is a chest x-ray survival guide the rest of the books that is chest x-rays for the medical students and the falsons that you can keep it in a ipad right this falson is a very good book here they have given you a chest radiograph along with that they have given you few mcqs based on the x rays and the explanations are very nice next is the abdominal x rays for the medical students and this is also a must read book next is clark's positioning in the radiography this is uh, basically asked in the final exams this is basically asked in the final exams so this book only you can see the images and the explanations given below so basically you have to read from end to end as a the chest x ray survival guide this osborn's brain that is for the ct and the mri both so you have to read every single chapter every single chapter of this book this is a must read book that is the osborn's brain next comes the web web is for the hr city chest it is very nicely written and you have to read everything of this book so otherwise if you are not getting enough time to read every single chapter of this book you just go through the images of every chapter and the explanations given below and the tables of this book they are very important so web is for the hr city chest osborn was for the ct brain and mr brain next is uh, aims amamc pgi's comprehensive textbook of diagnostic radiology that you have to read from end to end for your final exams 
okay so that you can also start from the start of the second year you can start reading this book next are the miscellaneous books amongst this uh, first is the granger and allison's diagnostic radiology i have read a uh, few topics from this book Next is the textbook of gastrointestinal radiology, that is by Gore and Levine. So, uh, this also you can keep in your iPad, and you can read few topics from this book. Next comes the uh, Yockum's Essentials of the Skeletal Radiology, and the Greenspan Orthopedic Imaging. For the musculoskeletal imaging, you can read through these books. You can read few topics from Yorkums and few topics from the Greenspan. For the radiological procedures, you can follow Chapman and Nakalinis Guide to Radiological Procedures. And there is one more book that is by Dr. Bhushan and Lakkar, Radiological Procedures. These four books you have to buy. First is the Rheumac Diagnostic Ultrasound. Second is Osborne's Brain. Third is AMS MAMC PGI's Comprehensive Textbook of Diagnostic Radiology. And the fourth is the Chest X-ray Survival Guide. These were the four books which I bought during my residency. One more thing is, uh, I would like to say like. These are the two big books which are very important during the first year of the residency. First is the Applied Radiological Anatomy by Butler. Second is uh, AIDS 2 Radiological Differential Diagnosis that is Chapman's. This Chapman's you can keep it, it with you during your postings. Next very important is for the case discussions, journals, articles, I have followed these two online platforms. First is AJR articles. Second is RSNA, Radiological Society of North America. Thank you everyone. And for the essential books for the physics, stay tuned. I will make a separate video for the physics 